Hey y'all, I thought I'd uh, do my my review thing of the movie Frozen, the Disney movie Frozen. And I try specifically not to put in like spoilers to give it away because one of the people will be able to watch and enjoy it, but um, yeah, there probably will be spoilers. I probably let something slip that will ruin it for somebody. So if you haven't seen Frozen and you're worried about spoilers, um, I'll just click off this review. You probably won't watch it anyway, actually. Most people, I mean, there really are so few subscribers, so few people watch my videos, so I don't even know why I'm giving that a little caveat, but I am because my concern is for the people. Kind of. I mean, really kind of. Yeah, okay, Frozen. Talk about Frozen. Um, I, I want to preface it with, um, it's been a long time since, I mean, since I've sat in a watch movie all the way through. Um, most of y'all know this. Uh, I started watching Frozen a couple of months ago. Our family was spending time with the Neary family. Um, after, after dinner we started watching Frozen and, um, we, we had to come home. Um... So, I only saw like half of it. Well, see, my daughters and uh, my wife had seen it before. Um, but I'd never seen it. And, um, of course, I was razzed about that. Like, I'm razzed about most movies because, you mean you haven't seen it? You should watch it. I, I really <laughs> don't put a lot of junk into it. I mean, I, I just don't finish the movies very often. And even some movies that I finished, I don't remember the ending. People are talking about it, and I don't remember it. Sometimes, uh, you probably noticed this, I'll quote lines from movies that I haven't actually seen. Because it's a memorable scene, or, or just a memorable line that's repeated and satirized and stuff, so I know it. I did the same thing for Frozen. Let it go, let it go. I sing that even though I'd never seen the part of the movie that had that song in it. And then there's the, um, you know, at the beginning, there's a song, um, or Anna, come on, play with me or whatever, um, when Anna kept coming to the door and, and her sister said to the door, go away, Anna. She goes, okay, bye. Well, see, I'd seen that scene a couple months ago, um, and I have watched a lot of satires of that, that part, um, where she goes, okay, bye, you know, and, but I just, <laughs> it was, it was a fun song catching all that, but I had, um, no urge to go see the movie, and that's not saying it wasn't a good movie, because I did watch, and it was, it was a good movie, um, didn't move me. I mean, it wasn't, um, what's the word? Very predictable. That's the word. Because most Disney movies, you know, the first five minutes, oh, it's going to end happily ever after. And you knew this was going to end happy after. That part is enough is given. It's going to end happily ever after. It's a Disney animated movie. The good girl is going to win. You know, the princess is going to be crown or whatever good stuff's gonna happen um you didn't know how it was gonna happen so I was thinking it didn't happen in Frozen the way you'd expected it to happen um I'd seen the first what 10 minutes whenever Anna just gets proposed to by that one guy oh let's get married and I was just like this is stupid I mean who marries somebody they met five minutes ago well, unfortunately, a lot of people do, but those marriages don't last. And that's because real marriage is based on commitment, decisions. Um, it's not ma based on your feeling. You know, a relationship typically starts out with feeling. But it doesn't last on feeling. Because feelings change. You know, um, that... Feeling that they had that love at first sight when you first see somebody, if you are moved, love at first sight, great. 
I love the idea of love at first sight. I don't think you should commit your entire life based on that. Because that's first sight. First sight changes. Because eventually you've got all those people who have fallen out of love with someone. That just means that they're not attracted to that person anymore. There's something physical. You are basing it on the wrong thing, basically. Um, because true love is a commitment. And I know this because I've been married for a while. You know, you've got to be committed. You've got to make a choice. It's a choice. Every day you've got to choose. And it's important. And I choose my wife every day. And I, I didn't see this happening to Anna. Yeah, she's cute. You know, as, you know, but not the most cute Disney girl. That's probably weird when you say that. But some of the girl, Disney girls are, are really cute characters. And she's not. She's just kind of annoying. <laughs> I mean, I mean, kind of. I mean, yeah. She might be fun to be around for like 10 minutes. But I was like... This Prince guy, I don't even remember his name now, Prince guy was like going to marry a girl he just met who was just kind of cute. Kind of annoying. <laughs> I'm just like, no, it's, it's something sounded fishy there. So uh, what ended up happening wasn't, wasn't bad. I didn't foresee it, but it wasn't, I mean... Wasn't bad. Okay. Um. Because I don't want to give it away. But it, uh. I mean, it, and it, it's a decent movie. I watched it all the way through. It's a decent movie. Not gonna watch it again. I don't. I, yeah, I really don't think. I mean, I don't think I'll go out and choose to watch it. But if somebody important to me is watching it, like if. My daughters are watching it. I will sit down and watch it with them. I mean, because mostly to spend time with them. Uh, if so, if my good friends or my my wife, but somebody else turns it on, I'll I'll okay. I'll be in the same room with it. If they turn it off, that's that not gonna hurt me either. Because it just we finished watching it this week. Um, my wife and I. Went and had dinner with the Neeries, and we started watching it again, and watched it all the way through this time. And, um, great. Now I can say that I've watched it. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. But, uh, that's all. Say that I watched it. <laughs> Not that it's great. Um, Frozen. Yeah, and and even the high, and not the princess, because um, Elsa was the queen, not the princess. She's still, uh, I'd rank her below, um, definitely below Ariel. Um, Ariel was was cute all the way through the movie, um, legs and no legs. It's just like, but Elsa, there were parts where her beauty wasn't, she just wasn't beautiful. And it wasn't stunning. I guess I should say that's, again, that's probably weird me saying, but whatever, dude.